첫째 지난 검증 시연이 참석한 여러분들께 진심으로 감사의 말씀을 드립니다. 함께해 주시고 있습니다. 열폭주 현상이 일어난 상태에서 불과 5분 만에 화재를 진압한 그런 결과를 가지게 됐습니다. 이거는 좀 어떻게 보면 획기적인 결과죠. 말씀드린 대로 높이는 ESFL 같은 스프링클러 헤드를 도입을 하고 방화 포를 뒤집어 씌우고 신고하면 꼭 출동하는 곳에까지 기다리게 시간이라고 보시면 무조건 기다려주세요. 그동안은 방법이 없어요. 나서 2분 3초 아니 2분 3초 더 써도 
kind of fires is very hard to extinguish because it's the hazard of the explosion, the fluorine hydrogen is very poison for the firefighter, for the people. Uh, the idea with this technology is how we can extinguish this faster than other Asian and how we can protect the firefighter with less water. This additive uh, work in the molecular level that you can encapsulate the toxin of the smoke. This is why you convert the black smoke in the, in the white, like it's an steam, that you can prevent uh, all this hydrogen explosion, all this toxicity that the people can breathe in the fire or the firefighter can breathe and you decrease the toxicity of the smoke almost 98%. You prevent all these gases in the middle of the atmosphere, plus all these toxins and uh, cancerogenic uh, agents to, to prevent the cancer in the, in the firefighters. Europe, uh, in South Africa, uh, Australia start to use in, in our, in USA, the factory of uh, Tesla car, they are using in the charge station. And more we test this, more we start to use in the real world. We start to use less water, less time, and we can protect more our people.